Hello everyone, welcome to Unlock Maths. Today we have to discuss method of variation of parameters which is also known as this method of VOP, right? This is one of the methods for finding particular integral of a linear differential equation whose complementary function is known. Though this method is general, we will illustrate it by applying to a second order differential equation, right? So, here we have to consider differential equation of second order with constant coefficients. We know that its general form is given by this f of dy is equals to x, right? Where this RHS, this x is function of x variable, right? And its solution is given by this y is equals to cf plus pi, right? In previous lectures, we have discussed how to find CF for different types of roads, right? And we have discussed six cases for finding particular integral, right? Depending on this X, right? Now, let's consider the CF can be written. This is in this form. This is C1 Y1 plus C2 Y2, right? We have considered CF of this differential equation can be written in this form where this C1, C2 these are the constants and Y1, Y2 these are the functions of X variable. Now any CF of second order differential equation we can write in this form. We can check that here by taking different types of roots. Let's consider if we have this type of roots here. Here we have considered different types of roots. From this is we have find CF. We can check that we can write CF in this form C1 Y1 plus C2 Y2, right? Where this Y1 Y2, these are the functions of X variable and these are the coefficients of C1 C2, right? We can check that here. That means we can write any CF of second order differential equation in this form, right? Now, we have to find pi by this method of variation of parameters. So, for this we have to consider this pi, this given by this formula, this u y1 plus v y2, where we have to find the values of u and v and these are given by this integral where this u is equals to, this is integration of this minus of y2x upon w and this v is integration of this y1x upon w, right? Where this y1, y2, this are, we have find from this cf, right? And w is here, this determinant of this in first row, we have here y1, y2 and in second row, this is the differentiation of this y1, y2, right? And this x is, this is RHS of this differential equation, right? Thus here by evaluating this integral, we get values of u and v, right? So by putting this values of u and v, we get required pi, right? So by cf and pi, by collecting this cf and pi, we get required solution of this differential equation, right? Thus, how we have proceed for finding pi here by this method of variation of parameters? First here, we have to write down cf in this form. This is first step, right? We have to collect y1, y2. Then, by method of variation of parameters, we have to write down pi in this form. This pi is u y1 plus v y2, right? where this u and v are given by this integral, right? And this w is this determinant and this w is known as then by finding values of u and v, we get pi, right? And then collecting this cf and pi, we get required solution of this given differential equation, right? 
So let's check this procedure by one simple example. Here we have to solve this differential equation by method of variation of parameters, right? So first we have to find CF for this differential equation and we know how to proceed for finding CF. First we have to find auxiliary equation for this differential equation. This is given by putting this f of d is equals to 0, d square plus 1 is equals to 0. This implies d square is equals to minus 1 and this gives d is equals to this plus minus i, right? So roots are here, this complex, right? So what is cf? This is, yes, here we have to write e raised to 0 x. This is C1 cos of C1 cos of x plus C2 sin of x, right? We have to compare this roots with this, this one. Real part is 0, right? So here we have write down Cf in this form. This is, we can write, this is as a c1 y1 plus c2 y2 right where yes we can write where y1 is this is cos of x and y2 is sin of x right we have find cf for this differential equation and we have write down cf in this form from this we have find values of y1 y2 now we have to consider pi by method of variation of parameter This pi is given by this u y1 plus v y2, right? Where we have to write down what is u and what is v, right? u is this integration of minus of y2 x upon w and v is y1 x upon w, right? And w is determinant of y1 y2 y1 dash y2 dash right now we have to find w so here we have y1 y2 we have find this y1 y2 here right so what is the value of w this is determinant of in first row we have y1 y2 y1 is cos of x and y2 is sine of x this is y2 right and y1 dash and y2 dash right that means its derivative so cos x derivative this is minus of sin x and y2 derivative sin x derivative this is cos of x this is determinant we have to solve this so this is here we have cos square x this minus of minus of sin square x right this is we get this identity and we know value of this is 1 here. So we got this w is equals to 1, right? Now we have to find value of u. u is this integral, right? This is what u is minus y2x upon w, right? So we have to put all this value here. y2 is this is sine x. And value of x here, this is RHS of this differential equation. This is cot of x we have to put here. And w is 1, right? Now we have to solve this integral. Yes. Now cos x integral, this is sin x minus this is as it is, right? So we got value of u, right? Next, what is v? v is this integration of y1 x upon w, right? y1 is, this is cos of x. x is cot of x and w is 1, right? Yes, now we have to solve this integral. We can simplify cot is, this is cos upon sin right so here we have this is cos square x upon sin x 
yes we know how to solve this integral we have cos square x that means we can write this is as a 1 minus sin square x we can divide this by sin x so here we have 1 upon integration of 1 upon sin x and this is integration of sin x right now 1 upon sin x this is integration of this is cosec x right and this is integration of sin x so cosec x integration we know this is log of this is cosec x minus cot of x right and sin x integration this is sin x integration this is minus cos of x right now minus minus get plus so here we have this is log of cosec x minus cot x plus this cos of x this is the value of v right now we have find value of u and v and we have to put down this value in pi Now u is this minus of sin x, right? And what is y1, y2? Yes, we have written y1 is cos of x, y2 is sin of x. So this is here, y1 is cos of x, right? And what is v? v is this is log of cosec x minus cot of x. This is complete V. Y2, this is sin of x. Now we have to simplify this is. We can check that these two terms get cancelled. Right? So here we have this remaining log of. This is cosec x minus cot of x into sin of x. So this is the pi. Next we have to write down solution. Solution is given by this y is equals to cf plus pi. Right. We have find cf. Cf is c1 cos of x plus c2 sin of x. And we have to put down the value of this pi here. So this is the required solution of this given differential equation. Right. Thus here we have find solution of given differential equation by method of variation of parameter, right? So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Thank you. Keep watching.